And we are back, you guys, for the latest episode of Pokemon Moon Walkthrough slash Let's Play. This quick update on the team, if I didn't already say so from the last episode, we do have a Kadabra, no longer an Abra. I think I did, I think the only thing is I didn't actually update it. Sorry about that. So, picking up where we left off is going straight forward to go find Lily. Lily, where art thou? So apparently those circular dot well duh circular dot those uh circles are uh flying Pokemon. I'm gonna try to avoid as many fights as I possibly can to kinda get us through the story. If not, of course I'll go ahead and uh chop it up for you guys. Alright, so lullaby. Oh no sucks. Let's see. I'm gonna go with Pat. Okay, so clear. As long as it doesn't hit me with any bug type moves, I should be fine. Keyword there is should. What I was getting at though. Oh, there it is. Okay, so it's not that much damage. And then it is level 12, so alright, we're fine. But what I will do is, of course, if I do get stuck, I'll run into a uh, battle or whatnot that uh, do not quite go with the story. I'll go ahead and I will uh, chop those up for you guys. I know you guys probably just want to see the good stuff. Yeah, I'm going to get this out your hair. I already know how you are about your hair, guy. Again, he's a character. Okay, here we go. Nebby, Nebby, come back. She is always losing this damn thing. It is amazing. Nebby ran off into the meadow here. Mm -hmm. And right after it got into so much trouble on the bridge too, what if a wild Pokemon attacks it? It doesn't know any moves that it could use to battle. Ugh.
Well, so this is like it might be a short uh, episode, but probably not. And I should thank much Lex to and I'm sorry here. Let me at least do this. Okay. She's not healing us just for nothing. Hold, hold, hold the front though. I'm trying to like hurry and get through this socket. It's not gonna let me do it. And it's not. Yep. Hey, Trickle Mac. Oh, and Lily with you too. What are you up to, How? Just finished my trial, huh? Hey, Draco Mac, I want to see if I really learned anything from my trial. Let me battle you again. Oh, fucker. Sorry about that. Phone go on. So he still only has two, so this should be easy. Uh, so let's see. Yeah. Still go with Chip away. Okay. Whatever you want, Pikachu. Chest bump. They're bros now. They just chest bump. Official. And Poplio. Should I? Yeah. So he needs to get some experience. <laughs> and just put it out there on uh, the Pokemon stuff that I'm going, that I'm playing through right now. Doing pretty good. Doing pretty good. I said I actually love <laughs> Poppy a hell of a lot more than I do like the uh, Rowlet line, but. No, it's what it is. Don't judge me. But, I mean, I would like to ask you guys, like, who are you? Are you Team Pablio, Team Litten, or Team Rowlet? Especially now that the game has come out. I wonder if uh, that has changed for anybody. Like I said, I've been the underdog this whole entire time, and I'm going to stay the underdog. Look, they're pretty strong, but I wonder if I'll ever be able to beat my grabs at this rate. Hey there, Drake. Knew I'd count on you, eh? Thanks for tracking Lily down for me. What's this then? Oh, you finished the first trial too. I bet you used some style of moves, yeah? <laughs> right. Howe's probably rubbing his hands together in glee right about now. Oh yeah, what do you mean? It's all a part of the trials, yeah. After you clear one island trial, you gotta battle the island kahuna. Taking on the island kahuna is in battle is called the grand trial. For someone like me who's researched Pokemon moves, nothing could be better than the chance to see some more fierce Pokemon battles. Woo! I don't know about fear. I'll be the judge of that. Come on back to Iki Town. And what is that? Catch the tailwind and blast through Route 3. Okay, so. Upwards to out three. Out three, route three. Ah, crap. Wait, no, wait. Back here is not route three, is it? It is still route three. Alright, screw it. Let me go ahead and fight these last two trainers. So I can fight uh, that cat and see uh, what moves they are uh, that he has. Cyan, dunk, dunk, dunk. Ah, nostalgia. So. One thing that I will mention is I have, uh, I guess, heard, not really heard, but seen the rumors that uh, there is a possible uh, remake for uh, Diamond and Pearl, which it would make sense, but I'm not, like, I'm so not sure. And if they did it, it really makes me wonder, like, what the premise would be. 
and also, you know, oh, oh, Rubens are evolving, and what the, um, of course, what the premise would be if they would actually include Arceus in this, uh, um, this round, because, uh, they had the opportunity to do it with, uh, Diamond Pearl and Platinum, but they never did, and of course, they, uh, gave Giratina its shot in the Platinum, so I wonder just, like, what the whole... I know a lot of it will be the same, but like, would they change anything? I don't know. Charger bug. See what it says? Mm -hmm. From the food it digests, it generates electricity and stores it in this, um, and stores this energy in this electric sack. Don't want to know what that sack is, but okay. No, we won't be learning charge. Don't need that. I wonder what his stats look like, though. Especially knowing that it has a modest nature and it has mostly physical attacks. Okay, so its attack and its special attack is actually balanced right now. So that's not bad. Actually, all of his stats are pretty damn balanced, so that's not bad. I think there was one more trainer on. Did I ever come this one? Maybe I did. Yeah. Whoa. Uh -oh. And away from those flying thingies. I think I faced all the trainers on Route 3 then. Maybe. Possible. Have I? Well, I was just already in there. Alright. No? Anybody over here? There's somebody. Okay, not somebody. But he gave me a suit, but yes. I know what it is. Shut up. Shut up. Go ahead and give this to Snorlax. This should be it, right? So here we go, you guys. So you defeated all the trash along Route 3, have you? You shaken me from my calm response. My heart was still water, but no longer. Shall we start? Let's have a soul shaking battle. Yes. You keep talking about this red. I don't know if this red heart, so let's do this. Kinda. Rockety rough. Much that. Alright. Go with the brick break. I probably should have healed him. Are you fucking kidding me? Come on. Come on, fight through it. Oi. This is so not cool. Alright, got a slow poke. I think I'll keep the same exact thing. Fuck with those for Um, I'm just nervous about his uh, HP. Oh crap. 
Okay, so it's a, it's a switch. He said, "Well, that was just stupid." Oh no. Okay, I have to. Oh crap. Um. So the question is, which move do I actually go with? That one is 65. That one is 60. Alright, spark. Oh, well, no. It doesn't matter. I should, I should get stabbed on both of them. Alright. Got him. Okay. Strategy. Oh, now here's the thing. I know I probably should say this, but maybe he should keep it. It looks cute. Like it has like some little hair puffs. It's cute. That's not it. There we go. Alright. That was a fine battle. My heart feels as light and clear as the blue sky that appears after the storm passes through. This is proof of battle between your team and my own. A red card. Take it, my strong friend. Okay. The effects of red card are as I illustrated to you in battle. You will likely find other trainers like me around the roots of Alola searching for strengths. Challenging them together with your Pokemon would not be a bad reason to take a journey. So I'm gonna go ahead and do this. So I'm gonna press quick link on both. Gotta touch and hold the screen. We'll touch the screen for both uh, to connect with each other. Okay. Link trade. So I'm pretty much link trading with myself. Duh. All right. So you guys kind of see how this little mechanic is. So trade over that and what I'll do is over here I'll trade over someone who I don't have over there which is a wimp bot which I'm going to get one over here so unless ever those who have already played it you see how far ahead I am in one over the other 
The only thing is that even though I'm ahead, it's like I haven't played it enough to like really remember where everything is, so it's all good. While this is going, it actually is kind of a good thing because it gives uh, Kadabra some time to uh, evolve itself. So we can just go ahead and read this. So it uh, its habitat varies from beaches to seabeds. A natural scavenger, it will gleefully chow down on anything edible, no matter how rotten. Oh, that's that's disgusting. I don't like the sound of that. Oh no. Okay, and now we're just gonna trade these. Got oh, okay. Now I gotta make sure I trade back over the right one. Yeah, it should be that one. And where's my pot? There he is. So trade them back to each other. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So now I have pretty much a fully evolved uh, Pokemon on my team, which is gonna be Alakazam. Which I'm trying. Well, I, I know some of you might be upset that my team, well, both teams, well, you couldn't actually see the other team, but my team is looking uh, very Kanto. But I think it's alright. Ain't gonna hurt nothing. Alright. So we have us in Alakazam. And what I'm going to go ahead and do is, rather than off the bat use Alakazam for the trial, what I'll probably do is I'll go ahead and just start off with um, Rowlet, and then pretty much go from there. And I don't know, if, I don't remember if um we uh like immediately engage. So in the event that we do, just go ahead and set up the team. And yeah, that's about it. So I'm going to go ahead and save here. And thank you guys so much for watching. And I will see you all on the very next episode. Peace.